Kim Kardashian and Kanye West are moving into their dollar 20 meters mansion that has been renovated twice. Kim Kardashian and Kanye West have sold their Bel Air, California mansion for a stunning $17.8 meters. And now they are going to move into their 16,000 square foot Hidden Hills Dream home that they bought for $20 meters in 2014 and had renovated twice. But according to photos taken in recent months, the pad has yet to be fully completed as the landscaping is not finished and the pool has yet to be installed. The home, which used to belong to Lisa Marie Presley, has an overall drab look to it from aerial shots. The backyard is a mass of dust and dirt with construction vans and even a mobile office planted where a lawn and flowers should be. The pool is just a slab of concrete right now and the pool house has yet to be painted. Not exactly a lush landscape for Little Saint, aged 1, and North, aged 4. The front does seem to be somewhat landscaped, however, with drought-resistant plants and mature trees. But a driveway and entrance will look far off. The images shared are from mid-September and a lot of work may have been done by now, but it's hard to tell. The plan is to be moved in by Christmas, after escrow closes on the Bel Air home. December is also when Saint turns two. And they are also expecting a third child by surrogate in January. According to TMZ, the inside of the palatial spread is done and looks good. Kim and Ken I have already picked out their furniture and are ready to hang their massive art collection. The property has 8 bedrooms and 10 bathrooms. The 16,000 square foot abode has been through endless remodeling as work has been done over previous work they paid for. They have big plans including a two-story playroom, music studio and full-size movie theater with Dolby surround sound, it has been claimed by TMZ. Obviously there will be areas built for personal maintenance as the gossip site claims there are plans for a huge gym, basketball court, hair salon and a full spa complete with a facial and massage room. The property also includes the one's neighboring $2.9 million lot next door. As far as the Bel Air home, Kim wrote about it on Wednesday on her site Kim Kardashian West. Com. We just sold our house. We bought it in 2013 and then completely remodeled it. Originally, the home had a much more Mediterranean feel but we worked so hard on redoing it to be more minimalist and in our tastes and tones. For the architecture, can I and I envisioned having clean, sleek lines. We wanted to create a more modern feel to the home. The interior design was all about neutral tones and minimal furniture. We also repositioned the pool and added a glam room with its own separate entrance. Can I and I were the designers of the house and we were so involved in every single detail. When the new buyer came to see our home and wanted to be the one to give her a personal tour because Can I and I were so proud of what we created. Images of the home show the property devoid of any furniture except for a piano sitting alongside a painting of a ballerina. The property features a spacious bathroom with his and her sink alongside a ceramic tub with a golden faucet. The home's extremely roomy kitchen is a sight to behold, with an extremely expansive countertop that faces the steel oven and sink. Kim and Kana sold the Bel Air estate for almost double what they paid for it four years ago, according to a Monday report from DMZ. The site claims one acre property with 10,000 square feet home was purchased for a whopping $17.8 million after they bought it for $9 million in 2013. According to TMZ, that number is now the most expensive sale ever in the Uber exclusive Bel Air Crest community. The happy new owner is a Silicon Valley based Ukrainian philanthropist named Marina Acton. The founder of the Marina Acton Charity Fund is reportedly pursuing a career in music and is relocating to Los Angeles. She told TMZ that she found the property creative and inspiring. 
Matt and Josh Altman from Million Dollar Listing LA repped both sides on the deal as escrow was closed four days ago according to the site. After buying the home four years ago 37-year-old Kim and 40-year-old Can I subsequently spent another $2 million on renovations to customize it to their liking, with extensive changes made to the outdoor patio, roof, patio, and pool areas. After years of work, the duo began residing at the property in one of the country's most well-yield areas in March of 2016.